Hello, today I'm going to take you through batch files. Basically, batch files and a few batch files command. This is what a batch file looks like. It's got a couple of cogs and its extension is .bat. Now, there's numerous kinds of software you can use. The basic one that Windows gives you is Notepad. Looks quite boring. You can change the font, but. Oh! Oh, I thought I spelled ASDA by accident, never mind. Uh, don't save. But, uh, so you can download one. They go up to about £15, but even the ones that are £15, I would still recommend this over them. Oh, it's called Notepad++. It's free to download off the internet. It's nice and fun. Uh, okay. Sorry, I just saw a spider in my room and a little bit scared. So, what's... Almost every batch command starts off with is at echo off and finishes with a pause or a pause to null. Uh, just to show you what is the difference between pause and pause into the null. If I was to take away at echo off and then go control s, a pause says press any key to continue. Now uh, a pause into the null gets rid of that text but it still does the same thing so you've still got to press a key to continue it just doesn't say that and I think that looks better so that's every time I use a pause that's the one I'm going to use uh, now if you saw there it's got all this stuff that I haven't asked it to type now I don't want that there on my batch file so that's what at echo off does Unless you're like, I don't think that you would have created default settings for your thing because you're not a batch beginner otherwise. Because you won't have that if you do this. Yours will be completely blank. But that at echo off has got rid of this C drive window system. What was there? Now, in order for me to get the rest of that wrong, I'm going to have to do CLS. Now, CLS means clear screen. And that will get rid of everything on the page, so it'll just be blank. Press press key, continue. Now, before I do that CLS, I've got two things that I want to put in: title and color. Now, title is what is at the top. This is users churchy desktop basic notepad plus plus. On this, it's C drive Windows system thirty two, all that kind of stuff. So I'm going to change the title to basic tutorial. And then I'm going to change the color. My default color is 09, no, 0A, which looks a bit like the matrix, and that's why I use it. Ooh. What I'm going to use for this 09, and that will look blue. Now, so title changes what's up here. The title is, oh, sorry, control S. The title is now basic tutorial. That's what that has done. Now, if there was text, like if I took away that null and it says press and equal continue, it's now in blue instead of green, and that's what that color does. And a clear scene takes it all away. See, you're getting the hang of this, aren't you? Now, after clear screen, you can do echo. This is what I'm going to do. I'm going to, I want to have a conversation with no one saying, Hello, world. How are you? It oh, it is sunny here. Now, I can't just put that. Well, I can put that up, but it kind of lists it. What I want is for as if it's saying it one by one, not all at once. So I would need to clear the one in front, wouldn't I? just to get rid of it all uh, control s but see it's jumped see how it's jumped straight to it's sunny here that is because the way it thinks it's gone clear all that rubbish and then go type hello world then immediately clear it then type how are you then immediately clear it then type it is sunny but then pause so i i need to put this pause null before each clear screen Control S. 
and that brings up hello world press enter or press any key oh I pressed it twice sorry hello world how are you it is sunny here and then it will end now that are basic commands so you've learnt yeah you start with at echo off you got title you got color you got CLS you've got echo you've got I'll teach you this one echo dot and you got pause and pause into the null now just before I might oh where do I put it I'll change this how are you into an echo dots echo dots echo how are you control s oh I want to delete that control control c control s there you go so I'll say hello world then space you see that space that's come in that's what a dot does so if you want to instead of putting a paragraph in because uh, batch files don't recognize like a misalign like that they don't see that they you put in an echo, uh, echo dot so that's all that is you know. so at echo off that gets rid of your top line title changes this bit color changes the color of the font in the background clears the screen you that uh, prompts that's the command for typing in stuff for physically entering that's a misalign that pauses it and says press any key continue and that just pauses it and hides the press and you can do that concludes today's basic tutorial uh, some more coming up stay tuned and subscribe